back out here coyote hunting with the good old Ruger 1022. And there's my Savage Axis in 243 as backup. Hoping to get some coyotes with the 22. Do some more uh, dissection type videos. And uh, I don't know if you can see over there, laying on the ground. They do knock one down with the 22, about a 60 yard shot or so with a Federal Punch. We will walk up and uh, see what we've got going on here. All right, just walked up to the coyote. Um, we will use the hunt stand app and uh, pace off exactly how far the shot was. I'll put a little picture in there, a screenshot of uh, the measurement. Now we're gonna get into some dissecting again. What are you guys' thoughts? What was the result of the federal punch going inside? Did it expand? What kind of damage is inside? We will find out shortly. So according to the hunt stand app, it looks like it was a 69 yard shot. Just one thing I wanted to add is that um, there's a lot of ballistic gel tests on YouTube and things like that showing what a 22 will do. But in my opinion, the best way to find out what a 22 will do, especially if you're considering using it for uh, self-defense, is a real live target. Nothing can replace that. I mean, obviously you can't go around shooting people to, de to determine whether or not it's good, but hey, a coyote will uh, will work just fine and uh, help save a couple fawns along the way, some turkey, you know, get your deer population up as well. So it's a win-win. All right, so looks like my uh, little autopsy or necropsy, if you want to be more precise, is... Um, going to be a short one. It uh, looks like I got a neck shot through and through, which probably explains why Coyote dropped in its tracks. Uh, I could probably, if I want to, I could probably cut the meat away from the, the vertebrae there and uh, can see if it was smashed or not. be interesting to see if the Federal Punch actually would have been able to do that. And this Coyote is actually a little older than I thought. It does have tartar buildup on his teeth so not a pup like I first thought and some chip canines as well so just a smaller female um, which is fine females have puppies this one won't be having any more all right so I've pretty much completed all I'm gonna do here um, I've taken most of the meat off from the neck just to see where the damage was and what actually took place uh, the federal punch did go through missed the trachea and the jugular on this side as well. And however, it did smash the vertebra. A uh, good part of this one here is missing altogether. You can see you got fractured vertebra bits inside here by the tip of the knife. So, went in, smashed the vertebra, exited out the other side, dropped the coyote in its tracks. Unfortunately, I've got no data with the Federal Punch as of yet for internal organ damage. We will have to try again at a later date with another willing participant. 